Hey folks, this is Brian again with Survival on Purpose. And I'm out here under the tarp, as you can see on a, you might can hear the rain hitting, hitting the tarp on a kind of drizzly afternoon. And I thought this would be a very appropriate time to talk about a real, real inexpensive piece of gear that I think everybody needs. And it's a poncho. And here's the poncho I'm gonna talk about. You can see it's a red ledge poncho. And you can also see, if you can look right there at the price tag, can you see, let me see if you, five bucks. Five, that's right, five bucks. Now, I thought five bucks is gonna be a one-shot throwaway poncho. I bought these from uh, when last camp out we went on with the Boy Scouts. It was, it was gonna rain, I knew we need some ponchos. Uh, I had previously bought some really, I think they were maybe three or four bucks at Walmart, maybe five bucks even. And they were definitely throwaway ponchos. They lasted less than one weekend. So I didn't have my high hopes when I bought these, but we happened to be up at REI. I bought these at REI, which is not known for really low price stuff. But they're known for good stuff, just not low price stuff. So I actually have some rain gear from Red Ledge that I had, had, have had for, gosh, 15 years now. It's really good rain gear, it's, but it's more of a suit type rain gear. It's not just, it's, so I wanted a poncho, something we can wear over our pack or whatever. So anyway, five bucks, thought, nah, whatever. We'll use it one weekend, throw it away, it's fine. But kind of happy with it. Comes in this little snap pouch. I want to show you this, what you get for five bucks, because I was really pleasantly surprised. So it comes in this little snap pouch. It's nothing fancy, but it's pretty thick plastic. It's got two little snaps on it. Uh, in my opinion, it's way, way better than the uh, ones at Walmart for about the same price. Um, so I'm gonna readjust the camera and let you get a, get a better look at the at the poncho. Maybe I'll just step back. Let's see. Okay, so I was able to fold it back up and get it back in the pack, which is a miracle in itself. But, but I don't know what mill it is. It may say, we'll look at that, but you can see it's, I don't know if you can see this, but it's pretty, it's a lot thicker than the ones at Walmart. And again, I'm not knocking Walmart. I'm just, it is what it is. What else I like about it, it's got little snaps on the side that you can, um, snap it up or unsnap it and so the little plastic rubbery rubberized kind of snaps and they work really well so they, they allow you to snap it down and keep it from flapping in, in the wind which the uh, other ones at walmart did not have and again i'm not trashing walmart but they have different colors it's uh it's not super long it's probably let's see let's see i'll get out in the rain if you can see so it's down to about Here's my shoulder, just, just below my pockets. So just, just below your pockets. But it does have snaps. And it is a little heavier duty. Like I say, I've, I've folded this one back up, put it in, and you can put it back in the package and throw it in your pack. And for five bucks, it just seems like a no brainer. I'm trying to see if it tells you what mill it is. It doesn't say what mill it is. It says it is lightweight, durable PVC material. It's 52 by 80 inches full size. And it is a red ledge poncho. I'll try to put a link down here below the video to it. Just if, if you have trouble finding it in your area. But they had some $30, $40 ponchos also. And they're definitely a lot better. But I just figured for five bucks I got... I gotta buy four of them, so, so it's a lot better. I'd rather spend 20 bucks than uh, you know, 120 bucks on some ponchos. So it's not gonna last you forever. It's definitely not gonna be a super heavy duty item, but if you throw it in your pack, you can definitely get a lot of use out of it for five bucks. So hope this has been helpful. If you liked the video, I hope you'll um, click the little thumbs up thing down below. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe. Maybe you can get in my contest, watch the video about the contest. And once again, this has been Brian with Survival on Purpose, remember? Survival's not an accident. See you next time.